Space. The final frontier. These are the voyages of some Kerbals we put together at the last minute. Their ongoing mission to seek out new life and new civilizations, to the line that I've forgotten, and to boldly go into planets at speeds no one has ever crashed into planets at before. It feels weird that I've never modded Kerbal Space Program. It's kind of... I feel dirty and immoral inside. And when you kind of think, what's the first mod I'm going to add? Of course it has to be the Starship Enterprise, which, after a small amount of testing, I've decided to launch this way and not up, because that just means it falls over all the time. Uh, I do like the fact that if you go inside, they actually have built a, uh, an inside for it. That's fair. That makes me very happy. Uh, right, so, to make this thing go, we just need to spool it up a little. Actually, no, don't spool it up a little. We've got... Oh, God. See, I attached it to these to make it look a bit more nice and presentable and not fallen over. But that may be a problem. Hang on. Release. Go! Okay, pull up, pull up, pull up, pull up, pull up. Pull up. Okay, down, down, down. This thing is fast. Right, this is, a, this is a mod that adds a whole bunch of spaceships. This is the only one that I've tested so far. And this thing is fast. It's ludicrously fast. Like, yeah, the tiny amount of speed that I've got on right now is just ridiculous. Oh. Someone's on the someone's on the bridge. There we go. Oh, isn't it beautiful? Isn't it just beautiful? All right, so if we pull up a little bit, oh, we're uh, we're slowing down a little, but we've got, as you can see by the uh, the uh, throttle, we've got a lot on the uh, we've got a lot left in the tank for this little guy. In fact, it's actually quite hard to take this thing off because as you can see it starts to get drag on it. Look, little drag down up here. We're going just a little bit too fast. There we go. We're going to just go vertically up. Uh, it has, if we shrink this down, electrical charge and warp plasma. The warp plasma drains at a ridiculous rate. And you end up getting stuck everywhere. So that's fun. I try to get to the the. Actually, no. Let's have a let's have a proper shot. Of trying to get to the old uh, the moon. There we go. Right. So if you want to see how fast this thing can go, full speed. Ah, bad things. Right. So don't go full speed in atmosphere. Don't go to a warp in atmosphere. That seems like that's never going to go well for anyone. I'm now going at this sort of speed, but I've speeded up too much. What does it look like from the front? Yep, that's uh, that's quite clearly on fire. Are you threatening to punch someone? Oh, you are as well. Ooh. Hello! What other views do we have? Oh, this poor bastard doesn't get to see what we're doing. He's like, what's happening? What's going on? There's people wandering around, apparently. Right, hang on. Let's swap out this one. Are uh, we out of atmosphere yet? No, we should probably go up where there's less atmosphere. See, we immediately cooled down. I mean, the fastest way to cool down would be to clearly crash back into the ocean. But uh, no, let's head to the let's head to the moon, as we are, uh, as it were. Steady on now, steady on now, slow. A little bit faster than that, but slow. It's like there's no there's no middle ground, and space. Ah, uh, the yes, okay. Hang on, right, steady, steady, steady. Right over there, and then over that way a bit. And then normally you'd have to worry about where it's heading and stuff, but we'll catch up to it pretty quickly. Right! Full speed, here we go! And then you can see that the planet just fucks off into the background as we go to... I don't think we go to warp speed, I don't think we break light speed, do we? He don't know. Right, let's just make sure that's going kind of straight. Whoop! We've left the old uh, planet, so now it thinks it's this way around. So let's just rotate it. Nicely done. Okay, and then we want to go left a little. <laughs> the moon is just left, just a little bit left. Right, let's cut the engines off there. We're currently going at about, what's that? 100,000 meters a second, which is pretty fast. Uh, and our warp plasma is uh, recharging, so you have to be a bit careful with it. The moon is, oh, it's slightly to our, it's actually, we can go to this view, can't we? Okay, we need to, let's just pause. There's no pause. Oh God, oh God, oh God. Let's add a maneuver just to get ourselves over there. Actually, it's going to take too long. So what we have to do, because we're panicking now, is just aim all the way over there, and then give it a bit more of a kick. Over there with a bit more of a kick. Over there with a bit more of a kick. Let's get in there. Over there with a bit more of a kick. Over there with a bit more of a kick. Kick, 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 kick. A bit more, a bit more, a bit more, a bit more. Are we making it? Yep. Yeah. And yes, there we go. We're now going to hurtle straight into the moon. Marvellous. We're going to land in that big smoking crater. Thank God he landed in that smoking crater. Nice. Right. Well, we might as well just now sort of fly towards it a bit. Full speed! Let's hit it at ludicrous speed. Let's hit it at ludicrous speed. Let's hit it at ludicrous speed. Oh, shit. Here comes the moon. Yep. So now we're pretty much heading towards the moon. Oh, that sounds like errors are happening. <laughs> Bye, the USS Enterprise! And it didn't, it didn't. That's a whole moon coming at us right now. Ah! Fuck, I'm in the moon. We actually buried ourselves in the moon. There we are. So yeah, they managed to bury themselves. 
that far into the moon before the game realised they were in the moon. Oh well, hang on a second. That's no moon! Oh wait, yes it is. Right, let's uh, revert the space plane hangar. Let's kick that thing off and let's launch something else. Uh, right, there's... Goodbye. These are the list of things that we have. There's a Borg cube, which I haven't tried to fly yet. So let's try and fly that now. Oh, hang on. Borg cube section. Ooh, nice. Right, let's try a Borg cube section. So that was the one I tested. These are all going to be just... Let's see how they go. Uh, oh, it's a ditty! Yeah, that's not, that's not a full Borg cube. Right. Power off. Space bar on. Up a little. Oh, no, it's definitely it's pointing that way. Okay, right. <laughs> That's a frictiony takeoff there. Oh, actually, that's max speed. It doesn't go very fast at all. And pull it up. Oh, does it not have a? Does it? Does it actually fly? Oh, it does actually fly. There we go. Do 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 do. The most aerodynamic of shapes. Spaceships don't need to be aerodynamic if you build them in space. That's why the uh, the, the Borg always have their spaceships, their their space thingies outside whenever you see them. It's because they build these sort of things. Because in space you don't need you know anything beyond that. Also, that's a fucking cool design with the green and the blubs. I like, I like the Borg. They're fun. I wouldn't want to be one though, but you know, whatever. Uh, right, we've got nothing apparently. What else we have? We've got some more plasma, which ain't doing jack. It's really slow. Why is this max speed? It's just warp plasma. Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Stay steady. Sass force. Ooh, you don't want your sass force to fall off. Yeah, we actually put this quite easily in orbit. Man, this would have been easier to smash into. Oh, this little trapdoor there. What's in the little trapdoor? Oh, that's a that's a that's a thingy. There's Jebediah Cabin! Transfer. Where do I want to transfer him to? Transfer him to the main module. Uh, transfer him to the crew hatch. I don't know. Don't transfer him anywhere. Awesome. Right, we're starting to really heat our little ball cube up. Whoa, we're getting some speed up now. Maybe we're more of a space thing. Can we actually try and plow every single one of these into the moon? Whoa! Steady on! We've got a little bit of a... Force playing with us now. Right, okay. So we are getting... Whoa! Right, straight line there. That's not heading towards the moon! You lied to me. Oh, of course it's not heading towards the moon. Not even pointing at the moon. Wow, board cubes. Really maneuverable. Something we've learned today. There we go. I'm going to plasma and drop it off. Maybe we have to get, like... Oh, we're out of the atmosphere. How odd. Okay, bring that back, bring that back. Head to the sort of the... Again, this one's hard to line up as well. Head over there a bit more. Gotta, we got to head the moon off at the pass. Okay, ooh, 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 oh. Very, I think we're orbiting the sun, which is always useful. Uh, oh, no, now we're going a little bit too high. Oh, crap, down a little, down a little. I'm not, I'm not bothering to do this properly today. So you don't have to go and call Scott Manley and be like, He's abusing the game again! I'm flying a Borg ship, because I wanna. Moon encounter in 11 minutes, 10 minutes. Oh, look at that, if we, hang on, if we stop accelerating, we could add it. Oh, there's warp here. Oh yeah, but the warp here was already added. It was the thing that already existed. I was like, oh, that's interesting. Okay, what's the maneuver we have to do to, uh... hang on, steady on. Pull ourselves right into the moon. It's, it's going to be a pretty substantial one, I'll give you that. That's going to be its position, so we're heading for that little bit there. More! 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 Why does it think we're going to? It's like, uh, uh, I don't know. Uh, uh, it's here, I don't know. More! More! We should, why are we doing it there? What am I playing at? Do it as soon as possible. Do it in one minute. Okay, right. What do I got to do in a minute? Boop. Ding! Oh, fuck. Down a bit. Space is all 3D and shit, isn't it? Always bug me when all the ships and everything always face each other in Star Trek. They never, they never, they never bug it up. They never like, oh, we're gonna meet you, and then they would be on a different plane of existence. Not plane of existence, but different, just, just different dimension. They never met up and down. There's like one scene in Next Generation where they meet up and down. That's about it. Uh, take me to my maneuver point. Oh, you are fucking eager to beat the maneuver point. Right, okay. How long do we do that? Uh, estimate burn in 12. I'm gonna thingy. Now, some people said you got to do that. That's like that's like the end bit. So if that's twelve, you got to start it at twelve. Is that a thing? I've never tried that. We're gonna try that today. I'm gonna wait for that to get down to twelve. Just speed time of fluid. Twelve full speed. There we go, full speed. And then ten seconds, nine seconds. So this is supposed to tick down together or something to make it go absolutely perfect. And actually, it's a bit cooler with the two cannons because you can see how much I fucked you up. And ding. 
Okay. So we're now heading for that. Bit of speed, bit of speed, bit of speed. I think we're gonna collide into the fucking thing. It looks like we're gonna collide into the fucking thing. Hooray! Okay, that's spaceship number two. In the moon. Yep. Bye! <laughs> oh, can't even scroll out that one. The moon gone. It's over there. Oh, am I still flying away from the moon? I'm sorry! I think I went through- I punched a hole through the moon that time. Look at me, being Ramona's ex. Ah, uh, space plane hangar! Right, that's the poor cube. Is it still there? It is. Uh, what else do we have? There's the Doomsday Machine. Wasn't that from... Original series? Like, but, oh my fucking god, is that it out there? Oh my god! Okay, so that's a big one. Let's launch that. <laughs> yeah, that was in uh, the original series exploration. They met the Doomsday Machine, didn't they? And they crashed a chip into its mouth or something. Fucking hell! The planet's got worms. I didn't attach it. Um, full speed, go! Oh, that's fast. Okay. Oh, it stopped again. Up, 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 up. Where's the fucking moon gone? Where's that fucking moon? Oh, it's, it's hours away because I spend time in there. Okay, we're just gonna. I guess we're just gonna go up into space. Um, yum, 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 yum. Yes, the Olympic torch was a little bit big this year. <laughs> Actually, fuck it, I'm just gonna crash this into there. Dem, 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 stop. Oh, wow, that thing just stops. You're accelerating again. You're just hovering there, that's really creepy if you're just hovering there. Good luck, RSCC thingy, Mijiki. Full speed! Arr, pull back! Oh, it's just gonna keep spinning. Anybody in it to evacuate? No. That's going in the water. Oh, it's going to scoop up a huge amount of water. That's going to be awesome. No, it's now. It's just stop. Stop. There we go. Okay, wait for it. Wait for it. Wait for it. Don't touch the water. Don't touch the water. Ooh, I'm just going to touch the water. It bounced. It gently bounced off the water. <laughs> that was starting to creep me the fuck out. Right. Space plane hangar. How are we going to delete, delete this one? Um, yes. You go in there. Okay, that works. Uh, what else do we have? There's a shuttlecraft. But you can actually, because the, the, the Enterprise has a little bay. There's the shuttle bay door, so you can actually have the shuttlecraft in the, the bay, which is nice. There's just a flying saucer. If you want to fly a flying saucer. Uh, Enterprise we've done. There's, uh, whatever this is, Stargazer saucer. Launch it. It looks like one of the, the, the extra thing ones. You know, the extra, the extra nacelled ones. That's what I was looking for, nacelle. Ooh. Oh, fuck, 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 fuck. Why did you make it top heavy? Hmm. Well, good luck. Whee! Good skim. Good skim. Good skim. Good skim. Bad skim. Bad things. Bad things happening. Ah! Everything is awesome. Every this one's quite uncontrollable. Everything is... Oh, fuck, 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 fuck. Ugh. Oh, shit. I've clicked out. Everything's gone wrong. Oh, fuck. Right, due to circumstances, bomb my control and the fact that I clicked outside of the screen and thus caused fraps to crash. Everything went wrong. But I'm back now. Here we go. Take off, take off, take off, take off, take off. Yeah, this one needs a little bit more of a, um, an everything, really. Oh, good. I managed to skip across that. And then I landed in the water. And now we're windsurfing. Windsurfing with the starship. Okay, right. Ooh. That's a, this one's got a lot of kick behind it. And it's gone a little bit out of control. Hmm. Yes, I wonder what it looks like inside. They're like, yep, this is a, a functioning walk mechanic. <laughs> Poor bastards. Right. Uh, no, 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 that's not the... There we go, that's the view I'm looking for. I think we're about to go and drill a hole somewhere. Uh, okay, well, the actual... The ship's nearly actually completely run out of its warp plasma, which is nice. Good. Well, um, maybe it'll stop when it's done that. What if we just either just evacuate? We should evacuate one, dude. How are you? Oh, is the ship gone? I think I just saw it flick past. Is that the sun we're going past? Okay, this guy has been torn to shit. Bye. Bye wherever wherever the sun was. Yes, he's currently doing this path here. Out the fucking solar system. That's, that is in real time. That is some speed. Wow, that is some speed. He must have got like knocked by it and sent flying. Wait, hang on. Jetpacks! Okay, slay stuff down, 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 slay stuff down. 
Hey! Well done, lad! Right, now watch as the uh, sun drifts off into the distance forever and you're lost in the cold reaches of time and space. Although, look, I can negatively affect it with my boost, which will run out probably a little, little bit before we get home. Oh well. Thanks, guys! Right! Uh, yeah, we'll revert the flight. I'm nice! I'm not leaving him stranded in space forever. Unless he does something wrong. Uh, next up we have... Ooh, we gotta load this one. Uh, this is Voyager! Voyager's actually made of three bits, and it's just easier to load the damn thing. It's also quite a bit big. Right. Launch. No, I lied. This is another one that I tried earlier, and I tried to build it, and it went wrong. So, I'm using the one that I found. Okay, so Voyager has its own landing gear and stuff, so we need to go teeny tiny speed, two engines on, and then... Oh, oh god, there they are, there they are. And then retract the landing gear and gently take off. Oh, isn't it beautiful? A little kick of speed, and we're off. It's fucking big ships, these. <laughs> They're really fucking big. Uh, right, so we're gonna go nice and slow, nice and slow. A little, just one for the audience there. A little rotation. Whoop, 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 whoop. Nice. Okay, well, two, two rotation. Tom! Tom! Put the fucking thing back. There we go, Tom. There we go. Right. Ooh, okay, let's put these guys on. Let's stop it from going completely wrong. Let's have a look inside. Oh, there's a... Uh, there's Shikote there. Hello, Shikote! Confused as to where the voices are coming from. Classic Shikote. And there's nobody on that side because I'm sad. Apart from my own right arm. My best friend. Oh, shit's going down. Hang on. Ah, oh, it's time to get a little bit of a pull. I'll slow Voyager down just a little bit. Do you want to crash Voyager into the moon? Now let's crash Voyager into the sun. Not a fan of Voyager. I like the ship. I never liked the series. The series was dumb and stupid. Crashing things into the sun is easy. Oh, we you know the other one. Really, really hard. But when you've got lots of magical sci-fi power, it becomes a fair bit easier. Oh, slow. There we go. Right, just got to aim for the sun. What's our current objective-y, projective -y thing? How about if I do that? Oh, that's not me doing anything. Ooh. Oh, shit. Hang on. Wait. Wait, wait, wait. I sped up too much. There we go. Whoa, steady. That was just a little kick. We're still in the atmosphere. Ooh, we are going to be hot for a while. <laughs> sorry, Voyager. Not sorry. Fuck you, Voyager. Okay, we slow and we slow and a little bit of speed. There we go. Let's do that a little bit. And soon we'll be out of atmosphere and then we can just plow into the sun. I think we're out of atmosphere now. Plow into the sun! Ooh, little things come up. And then we're going to go fast. We're going to go real fucking fast. i got to make sure that this actually is going to hit the sun. It's not. It's not going to hit the sun. You need to go a little bit. You need to be a little bit to the down and then up and then the left and down. Like aim for a sort of bearish. We're going towards the sun. Let's go towards the sun. Let's go towards the sun now. Lovely, lovely. Hang on. Let's just keep an eye for it. Oh, we need to rotate as well because I need to be able to see. Okay, take your engines. Cut power. Let's just line you up a little better. So you need to go basically just to the right would be good. I mean, likely, we w they won't actually crash into the sun. You just fucking red alert on me. You just red alert on me. What are you running alert on me for? Oh shit, you're out of fucking fuel. Alright, well it's out of fuel. Uh, at least a few recharges. It's just going to take a little while for it to uh, recharge. If we speed time up, it'll go faster. Making sense, making sense. Okay, we're not heading straight towards the... the, the you can tell how fast the other guy went. They were actually like four speed or whatever it is, or five speed and... Yeah, if we're just taking its time, that should be enough speed to do a big course correction. So we want to kind of go to the left a fair bit. Hey, full speed, 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 stop. And that is Voyager heading towards the sun. Yes, there you go, Voyager. That's for that's for millions and millions of episodes where you came up with really clever ways of getting home and then didn't use them. Actually, we looked at we're orbiting around the sun. Fuck. Hang on. Back we go, back we go, back we go. It looks so good from the other side. Yeah. Okay, alright. Let's just see if we can fix this problem. Oh, hang on. That one. Go faster. Yeah. Okay, that's there. Now we just need to go down a bit. Down a bit. Down quite a lot, actually. And then full speed. That's Voyager in the sun. It's gotta be in the sun. Yes, that's right through the sun. Brilliant! Okay, now we'll just uh, ride her in, I suppose. Bye. 50 times speed. Man, some miles away. 
There you go. Thousand times speed. And then th that's all the speed the other cup was going at. Ten thousand times faster than Voyager. Right, there we go. And then whoo, and whenever you see the thing that's on the news, it's like Voyagers approach the thing that's uh, leaving the solar system. This is the Voyager they're talking about. True story. Right, so I assume you're going to explode before you get to the sun, because you know, heat and shit, but we'll find out. Captain's log. Captain's log. Star date unknown. I'm unsure of our current status. Keep data. Reset experiment. Transmit data. Yeah, transmit that. Um, yes, do that thing. Transfer data that you don't know where the fuck you are, but you're heading towards the sun, where you deserve to be. Ooh. Ooh, look, I can open the shop by doors. I've added the shop by doors as well. There's no shop by in there. Well, there's a shop by in there. There's just no shuttles in there. Oh, that's quite pretty. Voyager. Hang on. We'll go like this. We're gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna, ha there we go. We're going into the sun slowly. Voyager's very, um, uh, Romulan. The silhouette of Voyager is a very Romulan silhouette. But anyway, in the sun you go, Voyager. This is the episode where, what was it called? Threshold, where you go warp 10 and literally see every single part of the universe at the same time. That's the thing that happened. He touches every single part of the universe at the same time, and then he devolves into a lobster. And also, was he it's like a big lizard thing, isn't it? Tom Price devolves into a lizard thing, and like Janeway does it as well. And then they fuck and have a kid and just leave that kid on the planet, like a lizard kid. And then they have warp ten, with the Doctor can reverse the side effect of it, which can touch every part of the universe, and it's never brought up again. You know what? Go into the sun faster. Oh, hang on. Shit! We're in orbit around the sun. Oh, don't fucking miss. Oh, you better not fuck. No, you're, you are definitely plowing into it. All right, you're riding this bad boy down. Are you white hot right now? God damn. Right, okay. There's the sun. Full speed ahead. Warp into the sun. Warp into the sun. Warp into the sun. Sun is really big. Gonna take a while. Oh, I can't do it while we're accelerating. But we're still accelerating, so that's good. Yeah, definitely gonna get ourselves into the sun now. Uh-oh. Uh oh <laughs> Voyager have gone squish. Brilliant, right. Two days and three hours, but I managed to wipe the bastards out. There we go, right, you can all piss off. The final one we're going to be doing, yeah, Voyager has shabby doors, who knew? There's two of them. Is this thing, I mean, it's like a blue box. I don't know. Let's launch the blue box. Seems the wrong way, it should be sort of standing up maybe, but no, well, maybe we'll... And we'll work that out as we go. Focus is the USS Voyager. Brilliant. Brilliant, 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 brilliant. Right. Hit space. Oh, sounds a bit broken. What's that say? It's a free, I don't know, free something or another. Okay, right, we got going. We're doing something. Got some speed happening. Got, definitely got some speed happening. That's going really quite fast now. Woohoo! Oh, I like this. I like this blue box thing. And, oh, there we go. Good spinning on that. Yes, I don't know what this is supposed to be. I think it's from um, Blake 7 or something. But it's a big spinny box. What's inside look like? Hmm. No idea. No idea what it could be. Anyway, whoa, that's going pretty fucking fast now. That's got some speed on it. Let's slow it down, let's slow it down, let's slow it down. We don't want to waste the, uh, what, what are you powered by? Rift energy. Again, they're just making, they're making this stuff up, aren't they? Science fiction for you. Right, it's quite it's quite difficult to control because you've got to kind of know where the front is. And there, full speed up. No, okay, let's put on those two guys. There we go. Okay, let's go up that way. You don't seem to really care about the fire damage you're getting now. Let's land this one on the moon. Let's actually see if we can land it on the moon. We have flown off at a quite a wonky angle, but I think we'll uh actually break this pretty goddamn straight, I'd say. Okay, point slightly towards the moon a bit more. There we go. Let's rotate a little, so back is there, left is there, right is there. Okie dokie! Lovely! Woo -woo -woo. Don't know what that's supposed to be. It's like a broken engine. Alright, uh, stop, stop, stoppy, stoppy, stop. That way, full speed, full speed, full speed. Alright, we'll drag that over. We're gonna get into a nice orbit round the moon. Or we're gonna just plow off and miss it. Oh no, that way, that way, hang on, that is it that way it's supposed to be going? No, that's not the way we're supposed to go at all! Let's add a maneuver. Let's maneuver our way. Yeah, right here. No, 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 not there. Here. Here. There we go. The one 40 seconds away, not the one months and months and months away. Yes, we need to go 
kind of towards this big thingy here. Uh, is that lined up? No, we need to bring it down a little. No, 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 do the maneuver. Please come down quite a bit. Lovely jubbly. And then over. Oh, there we go. Oh, we got a little bit of a wobble there. Right, so that's what we're aiming for. So, send me towards the maneuver. It's a very, it's a very good little mover. Oh yeah, burn now, burn now, burn now. This made burn was 14 seconds, so I activate it. Okay, nine and six. Okay. Well, we're kind of doing it a bit off as well. But maybe, just maybe, just maybe that'll be absolutely fine. Good, we're at the proper speed. And yeah, that'll do. That'll do me fine. What's it called? Oh, the USS Voyager. Oh, maybe the other one wasn't called Voyager then. Oh, well. Whee! Right, okay. Now what we want to do is... That's the moon, this is the moon encounter. We want to get it in orbit. Actually, let's not get in orbit. Let's just slow down when we get near to it. That's my plan. It looks like we're going to sort of try and crash into it. But then if we point away from it and whoop, we'll land right on it. You have my word. Oop, I did that a bit fast. And I missed it. Well, my word's good for fuck all. The Nerd Cube. The Nerd Cube.